Hello everyone. Today, let's see how we can set up a VPS server for Forex trading. When you select a VPS service, please make sure that you select a provider who provides remote desktop access. After purchase, you will be given an IP address, username and a password for remote desktop connection. Now go to your computer, search for remote desktop and go to remote desktop connection. Then you can enter the IP address and the username. And then it will ask for the password. You can tick remember me too and then click OK. It might take a while depending on your internet connection. Now you have logged on to your VPS server. It's like having another computer. You will see another desktop. Now you can simply go to your browser on the VPS server and go to your Forex broker, Forex broker site and download the MT4 or MT5 or any other trading platform as you like. Then you can simply install the platform just like you install an application on your Windows PC and you are doing it now we are doing it on the VPS server now we have installed an MT4 platform on our VPS now you can simply click on the application icon to start the program if you want to add an expert advisor you can do it as usually by opening the data folder and placing the EA or expert advisor within the experts folder. Similarly, you can add indicators into the indicators folder. Once you have set up your MT4, you can simply close the VPS server. Although you close the VPS server on your PC, it will work 24 7. So you don't have to keep your PC running all the time to make sure that your EA is working 24-5. Now let's close our VPS server. If you want to access your VPS again, you can simply do it via remote desktop. Also, you can pin it to your taskbar so that you can easily access the remote desktop connection. This time you have saved the password, you can simply click on connect. There's another important thing that you have to do, that is to add your MT4 to VPS server's startup applications list. So that if your VPS server restarts without your knowledge, you will get your MT4 running again. You can simply do it by adding your MT4 icon to the startup folder. And also it is a good idea to check your VPS server from time to time to make sure that everything is fine. That's all for today and thank you for watching. If you find this interesting, please subscribe to our channel and also check out our video description for useful links. Thank you.